Hey guys, what's going on? Um, it's been a while since I've posted a video, probably close to a year, if not longer. Um, so for those of you who don't know, um, I have a 1984 Pontiac Fiero. It has the four cylinder, which it only came with a four cylinder in the first year. So that's it there. Kind of poor quality, I do apologize. Just got the towels on the seats. So it's a rare seat package, one of only 290 that was sent to Canada in 84. In that style, it's a doe skin suede seat. Four in the floor, 150,000 kilometers, 2.5 Iron Duke. And uh, this is what I was gonna show you guys. So. I do have an 86, but I got a recently acquired. That's an 86 uh, base model Iron Duke three speed auto, 86 Olds Cutlass Sierra. And recently acquired this 85 Cutlass Sierra Brome with a 3.8. Now the engine is knocking, so that's quite unfortunate. and it wasn't knocking when I got it. Yeah, let's talk about that. All right, so this is an extremely rare uh, full gauge package console shift and it has a Vista roof which is a sunroof. And the only thing you can do is prop it open like this. Just show you here. So you just pull this down, push it up, and vice versa. It also has a map light, which illuminates the dash at night. Sorry for the poor quality video. Hundred and twenty thousand kilometers on this engine on the body. Unfortunate that it developed a rod knock about twenty kilometers after I put plates on it, but life goes on. Hundred twenty six seven two. I got it with about like that. Hundred twenty six oh three. That oil change stickers from September of twenty thirteen. So yeah. It was sitting. And yeah, that'll just about conclude the video. Um, I'll show you the engine and that stuff after, but I'm actually getting it towed and getting the engine rebuilt. So can't even do a startup because it'll knock like crazy. But um, yeah, I'm kind of obsessed with these cars. And this is now number two, <clears throat> excuse me, number two. Um, as you can tell, first one being right there. Very, very different from a base model. Auto antenna as well. <clears throat> oh, these allergies. And I'll just show you really quick uh, the difference between 85 and 86, obviously, being that the 85 is a black plaque there on the back. The other difference, I'll show you that too. The other difference being the grill, that's the main difference between the two see there uh, last but not least it's in a seafoam green color which is kind of neat I've always loved that green sort of color it's really cool it has the fully loaded hubcaps 
and luggage rack in the back. And this one has the full covers, base model, with a luggage rack as well. And 85 is the last year that you could go with no third brake light. So I've simply removed it. And there's the difference between the two. No third brake light. All right, signing off. I'll uh, do a startup video probably, I don't know, once I get it back, maybe in a couple months. And uh, we'll go from there. It's gonna be a little bit of money, but uh, you know, it is what it is. That's the fear of there. All right, take it easy, guys.